kind of nervous, but more like excited just to be here. It's nervous excitement. You know that moment when you're approaching the top of a roller coaster, but you're not quite there yet? You know at some point it's gonna be crazy, but you're not scared yet? It's kind of where I am. So we're here today at Old East with uh, CSS moving in, so the cards are slowly trickling in. It's been a few years. One thing I remember from move-in day was it was a mixture of like excitedness, nervousness, but I, I was happy to be here. Today we are moving in our seventh cohort of scholars. They are coming into their first year at Carolina, their first year as CSS scholars, and they're really going to get acclimated to the program, the university, and everything that's in store for them in the next four years. Four years later, I'm not the one being moved in, I'm actually helping them move in, and this is where it all begins. You're meeting these new people, you're rooming with someone you haven't like met before, but like you're all here for a common purpose. This is the greatest day of the year. These kids actually have no idea what they're getting themselves into. It was a lot at first, but you really get used to it, and the, the program does a good job of transitioning you into the actual school year with this uh, summer program. I am trying to balance wanting him to move forward and um, not having him at home. I'm a 1990 graduate of UNC Chapel Hill, so I am pleased that um, he is actually going to matriculate at the same university. This is actually really, really cool. So as we embark on creating the scientists of tomorrow, we're actually housing them in the oldest building ever in public higher education. All that was here when UNC first started was this building right behind me, Old East and the Old Well. It's very historic and I just think it's the coolest thing you can do to put tomorrow's minds and like the most amazing historic landmarks that you can find in North Carolina. I'm excited to get a leg up on college. Like this is my first real taste of the college experience, but like not head first. I'm excited to meet everyone, have some friends before I start. This is really the kickoff point for the Summer Accelerator, which is the, the seminal experience that they have as scholars here in the CSS program. This Summer Accelerator program will help the students acclimate to the rigors of a Carolina education. They've all signed up to take on really challenging STEM majors, and we really want them to get a sense of what it's like to experience that STEM major at its most difficult. They will get a sense of what labs are like, what research is like in Carolina, about the high level of world-class research that's going on on this campus, and it will give them something to aspire to. If excellence is possible! In terms of what we share, it's obviously a passion for science. We each have our own goals in mind of what we want to do. I want to go into medicine. I want to go to med school. Calculus and discrete mathematics, differential equations. Human-computer interaction, that's the field that I really want to go into. Biology, I love biology. It's my favorite thing. Currently, I'm a chemistry and math major. I'm not entirely sure what I'd want to do with the PhD, but I'd be the first in my family to, to get one. And I think that's, that's a really important goal, I think, that a lot of people at CSS have. One of the things that I value most importantly is connections to other people. So growth, especially with a cohort of innovators and scientists and mathematicians, computer science, is forming a bond between innovators is really important to me. You are living together with your cohort members and you build the relationships for the next four years here. You are taking classes, you're working hard, you're getting to know everyone and that community starts here in Old East. At the end of the day, what we're trying to create is the best talent that the world has ever seen. Luckily for me and my colleagues, these kids' parents have done all of the work. I am so proud of him. We are just thrilled that he has worked so hard and he is definitely ready to um, become a college student. I don't know if I'm ready for it, but <laughs> he's definitely ready. <laughs> I hope they graduate in four years with 4.0s and, and that they have learned something about themselves along the way, that they have realized they have within themselves what it takes to be successful, um, what it takes to achieve the goals that they have for themselves, and I hope they've made a lot of really good friends along the way. I hope that this new cohort can, like the previous cohorts, start to make inroads to change in the world. I want them to be successful. I want them to do whatever it is that they feel like they're meant to do, whatever their purpose is in life. 
I want them to try to reach back and help someone else make an important change in their lives as well.